Yo, what's up my fellow skill stackers? Hey, I wanna share something with you guys that I think is really cool uh, that I share with only my personal community, only my private community. I'm gonna give you guys a sneak peek of this, but this video is all about Google My Business and using Google Business Profiles, which was Google My Business, now Google Business Profiles, to generate more business. You may not know this, but 70% of Google searches are local searches, 70%. That means if you have 100 people in the room, 70 of them are looking for somebody locally. That's a massive opportunity that many of you graphic designers, web designers, motion designers are not leveraging for your business. So I wanna show you a little post that I did for a fellow creative that hired me to help him rank his business and he specifically does sign work, sign installation, sign design and graphic design work. Um, and so I wanna give you a little sneak peek at his stuff. So we're gonna go ahead and jump over to my screen. So if you look at this, this is month one. I put this in my Instagraphics group to show everybody. This was October 7th of 2022. You can see here he had an average map rank of 21 plus. So this is a 11 by 11 grid, but it's, it's five miles out this way, five miles out that way. So it's basically 25 square miles um, around his area. And if you look, he had a really terrible rank. Then you go to the next October 27th, so only 20 days later, and he now has a 1.1. How did I do that? Well, there are a number of things that you need to know that I wanna share with you in this video that are gonna be really important for you ranking on Google Maps. The first one is making sure that your Google business profile is 100% complete. When I say 100% complete, I mean that all of your information is filled out. What are your services? What are your hours? What is your website? What are your socials? What are your images? Everything that you could possibly get in there, the more the merrier. And if you wanna take that extra step, one of the good techniques that you can do is actually geotagging your images. Geo-I-M-G-R is a good way to do it. Geotagging all your images with these specific locations. The next thing you're gonna to need to do that is really important to leverage this is to be able to get consistent reviews to your profile. So going back to every client you've ever worked with and asking them for a review and making sure that this is part of your systems and processes going forward so that as soon as you take this client on and you do the first logo design or the first mock-up, whatever design it is that you're doing, that you get their feedback immediately, as soon as possible in the sales cycle. As soon as you produce that project for them, they're like, oh, I love this, get a review then. You don't wanna wait till a week, two weeks, a month later after they've already done the project with you. This is another really important factor. And then the last factor of this, this is really important as well, is getting citations. Now, if you don't know what citations are, I can talk more about that in another video. I don't have time to talk about this in this video, but citations, there's different types of citations and essentially almost like links that are pointing back, mentions that are pointing back to your Google My Business. This is another big deal that you really need to have. And this helps you continue to rank your location. Now, if you look down here in the comments inside of the group, you'll see I actually posted two other images that I think are really valuable for you here. You can see here, these are actually have the keywords in them. So this was for sign fabrication. Right, October 7th, 11.3 average map rank for this, and you can see where he was ranked there. Then you go over to the next date, and the next comment that I have, I think it's the same same date, or the next date, which is October 27th, again, 20 days later, and he's now got a 1.4. So he's starting to already rank, his Google My Business or Google Business Profile traffic is ranking, and just by consistently doing citations and posting to his profile on a regular basis, He's already seeing a major boost in traffic, a major boost in visitors to his page, calls, all the different things, website visits. These are all clicks for directions. These are all big things from Google My Business and Google Business Profiles that you wanna be leveraging. You're gonna be missing out on a massive opportunity of traffic to get more clients coming in if you're not doing this. So I wanted to give you a little sneak peek. These are some of the things that we're talking about inside of the Instagraphics Pro Network, inside of our creative community. If you're a web designer, graphic designer, or motion designer, and you're not in this community, I wanna encourage you, this is your chance. You're gonna learn techniques and strategies and tips and stuff that I talk about sales and marketing and graphic design stuff, all kinds of really neat advantages. So get in this group, get in this community, start learning. And if you wanna take advantage of this for your business and you don't wanna do it yourself, you want an expert to do it because you, you value your time, reach out to me, drop a comment down below, send me an email, go to my website. There's lots of different ways to contact me. I'd love to hear from you. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you found this enlightening and helpful. Google business profiles are a really great tool to drive traffic. I don't wanna see you guys get more leads. This is the way to do it. God bless you, have a great day. Thanks for watching and as always, keep looking up.